So hi, I'm Johnny Pepper with Psychomania Fanzine, and I'm here with the Doyle. Hi, Johnny. Hi. <laughs> How are you? What's new, Doyle? My she uh, clean on the pants. Oh. <laughs> I changed them. That's what's you did. Uh, uh, all good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Really happy today with. Uh, with the guitar singers. Oh no, I mean happy with the the whole Diablo uh, bands came over. Right. Kindly put everybody on. We're backstage at the Psychobilly like, really Earthquake and there was a whole like day of Diablo. Yeah. And it was really cool. Yeah. 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 Moonshine Stalkers. Jack of Bones. Jack of Bones. They Doppelgangers. Were Doppelgangers. Pharaohs. Pharaohs. Ricochets. Ricochets. Slings. Guitar Slingers. It was great. Thank you, and a brilliant idea. Uh, what to come up with the guitar singers? No, like to bring all <laughs> to bring all these bands over here, you know. I had a little idea last year with Tom, and um, I just wanted to kind of showcase the bands that's on the label. And I just said, uh, "You fancy taking like uh, some of the bands or yeah. as many bands as possible?" And he went, "Great idea." Yeah. And we went, "Fuck, let's go." Great. And um, yeah, we have plans for next year, Day Diablo Two. Okay. And that's just been sorted out for next year. Here? And uh, now it's in France. France? With the French guys? With the French guys, yeah. I can't say who's doing it yet, uh -huh. but we got, we got a little French location. We're going to put the bands on. Great. And uh, we're going to do the same sort of thing. One day, maybe in France, and maybe one day somewhere else. Wonderful. Great idea. We really like what we, you know, what, how we organized it. I think it's great to sort of have the, the newer young bands um, you know, doing their thing. Yeah. Uh, because it's kind of difficult for the bonus to say, well, nobody knows who this band yes. is. And, yes. You know, to give the chance to uh, a lot of the bands, and of course, um, you know, we're, we're all good friends. Yes. Um, as a family, family band, friends. Well, yeah, I mean, you're supporting the other bands on your label. Well, yeah, yeah. yeah. We also have some, some nice. We have all, we have, all the bands are really, are really low girls. You know. We wouldn't call them. Yeah. I love all the bands and all the guys are really friendly guys. Yeah. And um, we have, we've got a lot of stuff coming up next year. Yes. Um, coming up next year, uh, we have a, a, a lot of a lot of releases next year. Um, first is the Deltas. Oh. New album from like 20, 25 years from the last recording. They're in the studio doing some stuff at the moment, and they've just done a new track for the compilation album, the album compilation. Mm -hmm. Which is called Give Him a Slap. <laughs> Give Him a Slap, which I kind of nicked the idea from Give Him a Boot. Give Him a Boot, which was uh, a um, help count compilation. I thought, okay, we'll give him a slap. And um, Delta's kindly got together as quick as possible and they've got a brand new track for the, for the album. And it's got a mix up of Tim, Paul Cat doing an old Paul Cat song with the guitar slings. Well, basically, we were going to cover the song anyway. Which is juvenile delinquents from the planet near Mars. Mm -hmm. We thought it's a bit of a long title. But Tim happened to be in the studio. He uh -huh. says, Do you want to sing it? And he said, Oh, oh yeah. Great. So, oh, wow. When's that coming out? That's out. It's out. That's really? Sounds, yeah. Okay. You can get it at Diablo Records. It's out uh, on two different color vinyl uh, purple and green. And 100 over Well, that's another thing about you, Dora. Like, you really support the vinyl collector. Well, I love vinyl, and uh, I was in the vinyl shop. Yes. <laughs> and, um, I, I love vinyl, so I, I have to keep the vinyl thing alive. You know, I'd rather do vinyl than CDs. You know, CDs a little. Uh, oh, they're so cheap and crappy. Tacky and yeah, really that plastic thing. But the vinyl is, um, you know, I always loved. Yes. Yeah. I hope a lot of more people will really. Yeah. Um, start listening to more vinyl. And yeah. Of course, uh, if I remember, you, Johnny, have a, a very good collection. Thank you. A very, so. very nice vinyl collection. Thank you. Yeah, you do. I do. And, I love uh, it. You got some, some good rare stuff. I do, yeah. yeah, yeah. So, so, it's collectors like us, I suppose, that yeah. appreciate that. Yeah. 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 I mean, and it's not just older people like us who grew up, you know, you had to buy yeah. a 45, you know, and you had well, a record. Yeah, you know the whole vinyl thing. No, you don't need to explain about it. But you know, it offers a lot more with what you can do with the sleeve and the sound. Yes. And it's just, you know, with the, with the copies limited, make it like a different color, a different like patch or badge or something. Yes. And it becomes more personal yes. for me, you know, to do the vinyl thing. Uh, CD is just like make thousands. Yeah. Nobody cares. Yeah. 
Yes, yes. It's, it's very good for your car, but you don't appreciate it. You know, it's weird. I kind of notice a lot of people that you, you know, you, you, you make the album, they don't actually have a good sound system for this game. It's like, oh, we don't have a phone record And this is for some of the bands in the studio. They're like, ooh, how are we going to listen to? We don't own a record wow. there. So that's kind of, that's the generation, I guess, more people are kind of like, iPods. Yes, 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 yes. They need education. They need a lot of education. They do need some education. Uh, oh, wait, I have another question. Sorry, yes. Sort of on the whole vinyl thing. Ah, some labels are like, um, they'll put out um, uh, a vinyl LP, yeah. and then they'll have a CD with it, yeah. or they can even download the song. That's true. That That's true. Um, so I feel about that. No, no, no. It's it, it it is possible, but I think I'm gonna go for the vinyl thing first. If people are kind of want the CD, yeah. it has to be a lot of requests for it, you know. Yeah. And. Um, I'm just gonna stick with them. I don't you know, maybe better set up a little download thing for the people that has bought it already. Mm -hmm. And but at the moment I just wanted to enjoy the point. Right, right. Stay true, stay pure, yeah. stay oily. Yeah, yeah, thank you, thank you. <laughs> what else can I say? Stay doily. That stay a bit doily. Like a little, stay like a little doily. It's like a little doily, a little like doily. On, the, on the table. Yes. No, I didn't mean that. <laughs> Thank you. But your lace curtain Irish. Oh, my yeah. <laughs> little, little, little doily. Little doily yeah, yeah. Yeah. At least my name is Coastal. <laughs> or Andy McCaster. That's true. Yeah. People like doilies. They do. Yeah. They do. Yes. So um, all good. Yeah, so, yeah. Um, so Delta, some other bands are going to be recording? It looks like I take a load of coke, but I don't actually take any drugs. I just have a, a runny nose. Well, everybody knows you're clean. You're clean, clean, yes. I've cleaned so six years. Um, but sometimes it's difficult at a, at a festival. Yes. You, know, you got everybody sleeping. Yes. But it's still good. So yeah, uh, so we get the Deltas next year, and um, um, we've got to finish the new Slingers album, and that's out in November. We're a little Japan, a couple of days. We're yeah, hoping to do, that. yeah, yeah. So, so we we bring a new album, and it's a little different. Obviously, it's different to the last one. We don't want to keep doing an album that's going to sound like the last album. Yeah. So, it took time, but we mixed it up a little bit. It's a little more weird sci-fi sort of, uh, sort of psychedelic, psycho, psycho stuff. Really, kind of like maybe a little Zorchi, you know, a little Nigel. So but we're really happy. We're really, really happy with the, with the new album. And that's and really the only band you're playing in now. I'll, I'll also do a little standing for the Polkats. Oh, um, I know. yeah, I've done some shows with the Polkats last year. Boss can't play. If Boss can't play, um, I don't mind ten shows last year. I had no idea. No, I think I did hear that, but I haven't seen it. I've done a few shows before that, and I really enjoy that because the podcasts are one of the bands I grew up listening to. Yeah. Yeah. But, and then we start studying for them. But the, the, um, the singers, the, the podcast is probably the only thing I'm doing at the moment. I've got a few little projects jumping around, you know. But say next year, um, hopefully, we're trying to get um, as the events. Yes. As the events. We weren't supposed to do them this year. And then the girls try to get a couple of gigs so we can work it around yes. being at the studio. Oh, it's um, and it too much. So, so, so we got the ricochets and the. Uh, oh, hang on, Dawnies just making love to Johnny Pepper again. <laughs> well, that's going to be a long video. <laughs> so we we'll let them come in. But yes. No, I'm sorry, guys. So so what are you going to do the ricochets next anyway? Do you, do you Have you been filming it? All right, you got the camera on it. No, I'm not because it's not a zoom lens. Ah, uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so you've got a wide angle then, so I'll get my one. Oh, I don't think they're going to pick that up, are they? <laughs> oh, Ginger, you tease. <laughs> anyway, well, that was it. We were always at the end. Thank you very well, much, Doily. Well, that's the sound check, so now we're going to do the set. Oh, my God, I retire.